Okay, one more time, one more time. One, two, three. Amen. They are very careful. Uh, we know the, how marriage may affect our entire life. So people are very careful. Really. They struggle hard to get all possible information about that person, a possible candidate, as much as possible. But even after collecting all the information, Still, they are so scared. I have seen so many uh, uh, women who, who could not marry until 40 years old. They check out this and this and this. No one is uh, suitable, really. And then, even when suitable, yes, a, a person looked really promising, still they cannot make a decision because they are scared. People are really uh, uh, scared. But Rebecca decided to accept a man whom she had never met as her husband. She made this decision because she had realized that God had a plan for her and her marriage. She would marry Isaac, whom she had never seen, not because of Isaac but because of God. God arranged this and she would trust, she trusted in God and thereby entrust her marriage matter, the most important matter maybe in her life, her entire future in God's hands by marrying him. That's what it means to Marry by faith. It's the marry, marriage by faith. It's we marry because we trust in God who has guided us and who has a good plan for us and we believe that it is God eventually who leads us to, uh, into this marriage relationship with that person. 